Good morning everyone, uh, for today I have a couple of things that I would like to do, one of them is uh, I was working as you see on the screen, I was working yesterday modeling, well finishing modeling because I have for some time already almost done, but I was just finishing yesterday this wheelbarrow that I would like to add a few of them in the level and um, yeah, so I will do a few level design later, holding a few boxes around and put some of them on the farms and also in the market and uh, another thing that I would like to do today is uh, creating or spawning a few seeds that I have benches uh, inside of the, of the chart that right now I have like all of them are in the level and they are passed as parameter to the chart so the benches where uh, people can sit there, the NPCs and I would like to do this one with just spawning by code in the blueprint so I will do that also. And the last thing, if I have enough time, I will try to model uh, a new, a new small building for the for the market. This is a place for some performance. I have found a few reference, but more or less will be from uh, from my head. Just trying to create something, so a small place for performance. And I will uh, I will not finish completely. I will do all of, only the wooden part because about the um, the clothes I need to play a bit with uh, with Blender and this clothes uh, modifier and it takes a bit of time and also uh, it's requiring a lot of uh, CPU and I cannot do that during the during the streamings but um, but yeah I will try to do at least something and then try to finish later out of the camera so the first thing is uh, maybe we'll start doing the um, instead of using this well barrow I will start doing uh, the code for the charge so I will just explain you how it is going at the moment so the thing is here I have uh, a few benches ready that have been added to the level so as you can see all of them are here uh, the small one so I'm just adding all of them to the um, to the charge to the blueprint chart and all the benches are passing as parameter which is read a lot of them but no complaints but I mean I was just putting all of them and they just sign into the charge and uh, it's working well it's fine but the thing I would like to do is just generating via code all those uh, places to where to sit uh, inside of this uh, blueprint so for that what I need to do is just spawning and taking a couple of loops with a different distance to, to spawn all of them just matching with the ones I have already in the, in the level and they will be spawning when the game starts so after that the char will be using all of them it's just uh, yeah. if I would, I want to reuse the char what I'm uh, not planning to do but maybe if I'm just uh, reusing the char uh, in another uh, town I would like to have all of them and not really copy or duplicate again all of them so for that I will just try to do um, everything on code so the first thing that I'm doing is just opening the charge code because I have this blueprint that is managing uh, I will do in the construction script probably or in the beginning I think I could I could try to do here so for that I will do this spawn benches and uh, what we need to do is for each, so this for loop as I will do like from 0 to let me see this so I have here like a 3 here and 3 and then it's a 4 of them so the first one will be let's try to do only one row that's just to the two of them and what we need to do is uh, 
spawn actor uh, from class and the class that we need to do is uh, the send that I'm using here which is just uh, uh, where is the class here what is this just sit as you see what is sit pp so what we need to do is sit bp and we need to also define where are we spawning all of them so for that I'm just uh, split because uh, the only one that it is just the uh, transform location in that case it will be default and everything default I don't need more things like that but the only thing that we need to do is um, changing this one and then uh, we have this index so what we need to do is just multiply uh, by vector, so I would like to have this index by uh, vector, and this is the one that I'm spawning. So for that, it will be um, let's say 90, just to see where it is spawning. I, I, I want that this being higher than this one, so I see I'm not just messing with them. And what we need to do is, for example, this x let's say every 35 centimeters that will be uh, spawning and uh, I will add this one to the construction strip so this is spawning benches here and then we see what is here happening um, well, I'm not sure which one is paying spawn. Uh, also, we need to change also the. Um, yeah, I'm not sure which one is paying spawn. We need to change also later the parameters for this uh, CPP with uh, with the angles and also the uh, mess to use and so on. But at the moment, I decide I want to spawn, and I would like to see where this one is paying spawning. Because at the moment I cannot see any anything here. Mm, I'm not sure. Ah, oh, well, the thing is, yeah, sorry. Yeah, because we need to use, for example, this one, which is adding here the location of the, the chart. So get actor location. Um, what well, maybe I, what I need to do is get actor transform and then I will just break this one the scale is going to this scale and the rotation is going to the rotation but what I need to do is just adding both of them so it is add um, yeah but in that case this is just according to the rotation also so we need to do it's just uh, multiply by forward vector just to have the same orientation for this one. So, okay, actor forward vector, and then we multiply both of them. So, it will be uh, the orientation according to uh, the current, I don't know, that's the uh, rotation and scale and everything with this with forward vector. And now we need to add here this add vector vector and we take the location and then we are just spawning a bit more to this place okay so this one should be taking a location uh, relative or according to the current position of the charge so let's see what is this doing um, mm -hmm. probably nothing I really cannot find where the one is paying spawn in case that is paying I just I will let's check yeah spawn actor foil ah sorry yeah because I cannot run this one on construction script but that's fine I will do in this even grab when the game is starting so I will do uh, like lapping here and um, yeah, just, I have a few things here for testing that I want to delete 
so finally it's just spawning benches here after all the check-ins for the building so we need to play to see this one how it's going okay so I see uh, one of them and also the rotation is not well but that, that's fine that's, uh, that's I wanted to see where this one is being uh, spawned so for that what we need to do is rotate so I will add here rotation hi Rekishu welcome uh, combine rotates combine how's it going uh, I will have 90 just trying to spawn a few benches of the, of the char but being uh, other than that, just playing um, so I see this only spawning one of them. I think I'm afraid that it's only spawning one. And um, yeah, I'm not I'm not sure what this one's happening. This for loop and this is the index by multiply and um, let's try something bigger mm -hmm. nothing happened if you have any question or want to see some part of the project if you are new here just let me know otherwise I'm just working uh, working on a few things that I'm planning to do today if you have any question or want to see something just let me know there's nothing here so for some reason mm -hmm. Should be just being according to this one, but I'm not sure if uh, the axis that we need to modify is uh, X or I. So I'm gonna try again. Just I want to see a couple of things or three of them. Yeah, okay, perfect. So the thing is, you need to modify this I axis. So that's fine. And what we need to do is, okay. Okay, so you can see that's just spawning three of them, maybe not being well aligned. But that's fine because I need to have probably more than one meter. And also there are four of them need to be spawned. Uh, yeah, about the sequence areas I have here. Uh, I don't know what the question is about the video. Yeah, I have here and uh, about the um, artificial intelligence I have, but it's not really uh, from the uh, from the real engine because I was creating by myself. I have a lot of plans for uh, for the NPCs, so they have world plans like go home, go working, go to this uh, location, follow this path, sit on the on this bench, or some things like that. So they are just doing a plan for all the day. The thing is that using um, default uh, artificial intelligence from Unreal is not taking care about the time of the game. So in my game, the, the game is passing like uh, one minute is, uh, in game is one minute on uh, in the game. But the time can be faster, for example, if you are sleeping or working in the farms or things like that. So for that, the time is passing faster and not the real time for Unreal. And uh, in that case, I need to adjust or the NPCs are doing the plan according to the time of the game, not, not about real time. Oh, 
or this one that I have here, uh, you cannot see here around, it's just uh, uh, showing a pictures from from a folder. So they're, they're just pictures. This is not about. Uh, this is not the sequence that I have. The sequence I was just uh, recording from the game and taking a few pictures, creating a video, and so on. So this is uh, right now. This is just only uh, pictures from a folder. So it's obvious it's using like another source. But if you are thinking about taking a camera from from the level, you can do that choosing, for example, one camera. In case that you are doing, for example, here, let me show you. I have a few cameras. So let's say, uh, well, you can do things like that because, for example, let's say you want to take camera. Let me see one of the camera. In case that I have some of them, for example, this camera. Okay. So if I check this camera, you can see here the picture, and I can just pin this preview. So you can pin here this preview. And in that case, I'm just uh, not selecting, I can select, for example, another object, or a here house, or even I can move here. So in case that, for example, you are designing to take a picture, you can keep this one all the time, you know? You can see how is this one going. Or for example, here I will just put um, something, let me try to put a few, I don't know, something. Just here, you see, and you see how it's going, you know? So you take here the camera all the time, and you see how the level is going from the camera, but not really uh, the one that you are working, you know? Even you can change here, like, I don't know, if you want to work like that, or maybe you know, you are doing at this time working with lots, but the camera is just being here all the time, so there's just uh, nothing related to your uh, camera. And even you can, uh, you can select both of them if you want, you know? So it's just in case that I'm getting, taking this camera and for example I have here a couple of them so I can do let's say two cameras and then ping both of them you know oh, sorry okay in that case that's completely the same so I'm moving and I keep all of them all the time here just for you know designing a, a picture they want to take or maybe about the lightning and things like that so yeah you can ping any camera that you want so the ones that they have here just they are just pictures from uh, from the folder so people can see a few pictures even if I'm for example working on blueprints something you at least can see something from the gate you are coming just uh, in a couple of seconds you can see something and you don't need to ask like I don't know if I'm going to uh, another place you can see something but anyway you can just put cameras in your level and you can just pin them or unpin if you don't need anymore and um, and you can just keep working in your level with this camera or a few of them so the one that you see are just pictures, but could be also cameras. I can put a few cameras around, and they are all the time there. In case that, for example, using simulating or things like that, you can see things moving, like I don't know the grass or or even NPCs, things like that. So yeah, you can do that. It's not mine because it's a picture, but you can do that. And about the the AI for for the NPCs, I was explaining that. Uh, I need to take, uh, take care about the real time in my game. So it's not about the time in seconds for Unreal, but the time for uh, my game. So when it's going to be day or night, they change the plans or they decide to stop working, go home. But it's not with, uh, for example, with uh, a normal behavior tree, you have like after five seconds, go home. But in that case, during five seconds, for example, could pass, I don't know, a couple of hours in my game. So they need to do plans according to this time so I need to create everything all the plans and they are being managed by another kind of delay tax that I have I did already in C++ so it's a bit complex uh, just placing this uh, timer for uh, for Unreal so so they are not real artificial intelligence from Unreal but of course they have and they have completely planned for the world day and they have also conditions like changing if something's happening or I don't know if the bench is busy and then you continue to the next plan or things like during the night waking up sleeping working until some time or things like after a dialogue you change your plan for to do something different because you have been already asked or things like that so yeah they, they have already all of them and uh, what I was doing is uh, like two different 
things. One component is the well, is the mess, which is just a pawn single wall with uh, with the mess. You have the controller, and then it's managing all the animations and things like that. Another one is just the logic of this um, NPC, where I was just uh, putting there the dialogues, the um, the plans for the world day, and things like which house is yours on which farm is yours in case that you are doing or if you are doing any know, business or I don't know, a few a few more things so every single NPC have a few parameters with all the things that they can manage and after that they are just managing for example when I say just like uh, at 8 p.m. go home they have where is your home and then they know about this so for moving I'm using this um, uh, default this snap mess I'm using with a few variations. I need to few notes more, but it's just moving with uh, this nav mess, and also they are being managed going inside of houses so they can go and cross the houses and so on. Even managing the doors are open or closed, um, things like that. So all those uh, doors are being open when they are just walking around. So yeah, they are just managing a few things like that. Um, if the question about the Sequencer was only about picture or do you want to know more about the real sequences for the video? Maybe it's not I don't know. Well, if you have more questions or it's not clear something that I was just trying to explain just let me know So let's try again with this 120 Well, since closer, but need to be even bigger. And add any opening because I need to add some displacement from. Um, I didn't use matinee because I was just coming when uh, sequence is already working. And it's quite simple, you know, it's not, not much that you need to do. You have a few keys to put there, keys for objects, um so there is nothing. No, it's just just a hobby, I'm not working, it's not professional, I'm doing a lot at my home. I don't have any money, any, any team or anything, so I'm doing everything. No, not working in the industry. And I have been doing this project for 10 months already. Well, yeah, 11 months already, so I was starting with uh, this year. Learning with the engine and trying a few things and doing all the things that you see. So, what's wrong? Is this okay? So yeah, no. I was working uh, in the past. I was doing also another game with Sky Engine, so it was not the first, uh, completely first game that I'm doing. I was coding for many many years. So it's not new about computer, and I was also working remote in a thing with um, with uh, with a game. Uh, my miscreate, I was working there for a few months, but, but not much. Yeah, most people is just creating something that uh, they like and uh, play with uh, with the editor and so on because it's for free and things like that. Um, yeah, it's not not planning to be rich. What I need to do is adding, let's say, one meter to see if they are matching. Mm, I think it need to be completely the opposite way. So, yes, the displacement should be minus 100. This is closer, much closer. Oops, one zero. Compile. Okay. Let's 
a bit of displacement and also I will add something like 60 or 90 and this one might be 40 just matter trying to uh, adjust the current uh, location for those uh, spawning benches so I see that they are going I would like to have them matching and then I will just create a different message for that so the first thing that I'm trying to do is just match with them so for that I need to have minus 20 also minus 60 they are just centimeters I just want to check now the, the blender file to see exactly where I will allocate more of them I think it would be faster I enjoy what I'm doing, I like what I'm doing just, just for fun because I say I'm not planning to reach or popular at all just doing it, that's all so it seems need to be okay first a bit more and then a bit less here There are a lot of pictures on uh, the web also on Twitter I have a few pictures uh, I have a lot of uh, videos also all the streaming I'm already uh, later uploading to YouTube but there are like 100 videos and uh, I don't know like 300 hours so I'm, I'm not recommending just sitting there and watch 300 hours That, that's cool. I think that um, the most important is you have at least a game or you have some speeding, even if it's not professional. I mean, just saying I was studying but I never was trying even, you know, it just makes no sense. So if you have something, not, not about me, but I mean, if you have something for the industry that you have been doing, even something simple is fine. But you have something you can show what you've been doing and what you have been learning. So that that's good. Of course, you need to have a base, but. Or well, anyone can just try this and you see people like I don't know, 15 or 12 uh, years old that they are just trying doing things quite simple but they are already doing and they have something to show so I think in that case the most important is having something to show let's be less so There are a lot of things to do with, with the game, that, that's, that's my problem, that I'm doing everything and of course it takes a lot of time, modeling, texturing, uh, the code, the blueprints, the linings and also the sounds, all the user interface and all the things like animations, the characters, dialogues, a lot of things that you need to, well you cannot master everything but anyway, I'm just doing and learning on the way, um, yeah, trying to do the best. But yeah, you can just focus on something that is more interesting for you and try to make like portfolio for that. Uh, something more interesting instead of just spending time on everything and not mastering anything. Because in the end, for companies, they want someone that is mastering something at least, you know, not like they know about everything, but mastering something that will be your probably your current position when you are working there. Fine. Uh, what we need is a bit more. So we'll just add here. So just try something, try to do something then with this game jam, which is funny, and uh, you can have with another people just trying to think, you know, instead of just 
uh, I don't know, reading or learning books, which is also fine, interesting, but in the end, they are asking you a portfolio, not uh, what have you been studying, you know? So yeah, try to do something. Don't be worried about uh, it's so cool or not. Everybody is expecting that you are doing triple A again for no budget, you know, but don't care about people. They will start comparing your game with, I don't know, Minecraft, Battleground, or things like that, or Battlefield, I don't know, Witcher, things like that with 200 million of dollars, and they plan that you are doing at your home almost the same game, you know, at least, even for free. So yeah, don't, don't care about this. Just do something, don't worry about people, toxic community just saying, you know, nothing nice, but don't worry about this. Just do what, I, what you are liking, enjoying, trying to learn. And um, that's all. If you try, if you are doing something, at least something that you can play, just something is 100% of the people, 99% of the people just talking, studying, planning to start, um, planning to start, you know, I'm planning to do, but yeah, that's all. This is 99% of the people. So you would be the small part of 1% of people that are really doing the game. Just do that. Even for mobile, it's fine, everything. You don't need to be three player games, all of them, you know. Multi multiplayer, MMO, RPG, open world, uh, no, not like that, you know, just uh, makes a small game, could be fine. Okay. Ah, I see, I see what the problem is, okay. So. Or something like that. Cool. You can use, for example, this art station. That is just for free. You don't need to create anything. You have a lot of people there already. You know. Just just put your pictures there, or even videos, or everything that you have is really easy. Or just create a Twitter account. But it's more for social. But just having art station, which is free, you can put your pictures there. And all the community is just watching what have you been doing. So really don't wait to have a perfect website company saying that you have, I don't know, some stupid name studios, which is just you are alone at home. You know, just create something, put your art station and say, this is my name and this is what I'm doing. That's all. That people is trying to, you know, impress someone. I really don't know. I don't know why. <laughs> it's just stupid. Jesus, still not enough. This is just the old. Uh, okay, cast to seat. I, I don't think I need to cast. Uh, static smith. It. Hmm. I'm not sure this is the one that I want to have. Static this one. This is the one that I want to have. And then this is a paint. Six, I think. Ah, exactly. I don't need to cast this one. It's already giving me the object that is this type already. So, okay. The problem is, for example, if you have or are being more focused on code. Which is much harder to show anything, you know? It's just uh, almost impossible. Okay. So I have here warnings. Okay, I can move this one because it's static. 
okay set mess do I have a variable like that set mess and six I think what I need to do is is it the construction script? Yeah, maybe I need to move all this code because I want to uh, modify the the set after having already spawned. And yeah, I see it's just being ignored. Well, this is working, but need to be recreated later. Oh, I have also a few problems here with. For object. So yeah, put just your pictures or videos you have in our station, contact with people there, write a few emails, you know, try to make friends, or if you for example are interested more on games, just try to find other things that are looking for uh, college or people just starting, try to learn together. For example, this Unreal Forum, they have a lot of people that are looking for workmates or just college to do a project. They have a completely different projects smaller and bigger mobiles not mobiles so you can choose someone that you like and talk with them try to do something together which will be faster and you can learn on the way and you will have faster something to show that you have been working on it and you you have at least that experience so yeah you can try this one or just contacting on our stage there are also a lot of other places where people are looking for uh, people helping on the on the project so I don't think there's a problem for you to find someone that is working on a project that probably you like or it's more or less what are you planning to do and you can help them work all together and you can learn. So what I need to do is um, look here a function reconfigure That mess that that's what I need them to do. Um yeah, that's static. Okay. And the last thing that I want to do is go in this one to reconfigure so I can just call later at any time when I'm just changing this. Oops, what, what's happening here? Ah, uh, left lock, left row, right lock. Okay. Let's see. I can just free a variable, local variable, okay, compile again, now it's fine. Uh, let me see if, ah, uh, well, after that I need to uh, reconfigure. see if this is working because I don't want to create this one as uh, changing the mobility for this one that's not working and um, probably have a warning again that this, this mobility is not working exactly mobility is static so the only one that the only time that they have to change everything is um, 
uh, well I could just just start the kind of reading it this small bowl hmm I just want to change the, the mess later but if I'm doing the reconstruction script it's fine but if I'm trying to do later just to put which one are my um, objects with my parameters in that case um, it saved me that uh, this static app cannot be already uh, being created so that's why I, I was just thinking to create this one um, instead of spawning yeah that, that's, that's that's the problem well the option is just change to mob hold this one this uh, object that I'm just trying to do here but also some work in this blocker later left right I need to have all of them being uh, recreated and in that case what I need is all of them being mobile probably if I'm just changing them because uh, changing the reconstruction is fine you can change any, any parameter and this is just static forever but if you create them as static and then in the future you want to change any parameter you need to have them as mobile otherwise um, it's the same to this one that I have here like you cannot change later because it's happening already no change it or just create it as a static so even just creating this one as mobile will be just changing a lot of things and I'm not sure that I want this one by mobile but in that case it should be working is it working? I'm not sure it has been changed something yeah exactly so this one is being changed already it works and I don't have any warning already or do I have let me see clear log play game do I have warnings no okay so that's that's working with mobile I'm mobile and I will do this reconfigure later so I think that's working. Uh, what I need to do is so change here the mess and change also the size for that. So something bigger and the bench that I need to do is maybe five. I don't remember which one. Let me see here. Benches. Mm. Yes, this is the five, the one that they want. Okay, so I see that they are being here. Well, well maybe well adjusted and also need to be a bit on the top just to avoid the um, the collision of the of the charge that they have and this collision is being over this one and then it's uh, working, acting as interactive that's, that's the thing that I was trying to do I need to be even more that's strange okay uh, no. need to rotate and aligning a bit but you can see that's just spawning all the benches that we have, as you see, that that's just working. Of course, I will change later, like hiding this mess. But the thing is, you have the place where to see it. So it's just spawning well. Will be a bit less here. What we need is um, minus 90. So we just rotate in the different uh, directions for that. And also need to be a bit less. That's a bit tedious trying to find the right location. What will be easy when we have at least one of them just to be spawning all. Let's see. Yes, yeah, paying. Uh, um, let 
Let's swing this direction on the last one. Um, no. Oh, sorry, this is the one that I need to have here, and this is the one that I need to move the another direction. I think I was just misleading the, the axis that I need to modify exactly. Okay, need to be a bit more, otherwise, when you are sitting, your legs are colliding with this, which is not nice. So I need to move a bit more. And when I have already the position, I will just create a few more loops, uh, spawning everything around, but at least the first one. Okay, that, that's the one that I have. So this is one of them. Yeah, this one here. So that's going well. And what we need to do is just create three of them, three in a row, this way. And also another three here, exactly the same. As you can see here, it's just vain because you have all of them. And uh, already, so that's uh, yeah. I should just delete all of them. Charge. I will not delete at the moment. Otherwise, I'm just breaking this array that I have. So I will just try to finish this. Maybe the easiest way is to create this one as small function like spawn one bench, and I can just put there all the code for um, one single bench. So this is the code for that. And I can even pass this uh, those operations for that. I think. I'm just passing kind of index. I will add a few parameters here later. But just kind of index that I need. So let's add. No, no, sorry. Parameters here. The one will be. I can do something like row column. Here, and I will try to add, adjust later. So, this is coming here. So I will just do something more generic. So in that case, this is just spawn one bench, and this is the row that we are passing. But for example, at the same time, we need to pass um, another parameter for that, like uh, the column. So let's say that this one's coming here. This is column one. And this is column two of them. And I will add code to manage this uh, this column number here. So for the column number what I need to do is multiplying uh, yeah I need to have here value multiplying by this and we just duplicate things i will do much clearer later just as something faster so in that case what i need to do is add two vectors and this is the one that i'm multiplying when i have already the location and position and that way it's just for example every 35 or every 50 
centimeters to see so it should be already spawning three of them and then four rows if everything so well hope so well not I was expecting to have here three of them so um, this is going this way or that way mm -hmm. I think it should be working Uh, the problem is the forward vector um, yeah the forward vector is just having zero on this one so I'm just multiplying and then exactly the same not really spawning because in that case what I need to do is multiplying by right vector okay actor right vector okay so this one is being multiplied by this and this is the forward vector being multiplied by this so what I need to do is multiply this multiply this and then it's being add okay and here we have exactly the same for this case oops right vector and then it's adding this we have both axes but also according to the rotation of the charge already okay perfect so as you can see it's just taking um, this one is too close but that's fine it's just working so more things that we need to do is so let's say 75 I don't know running one bench so now it is just changing all the property for all the one function okay we need to have a bit more exactly so it's almost fine maybe a bit less this one is fine and this will be 70 ok because the thing is just for example sitting here you need to have some space on this side and also some space here and for example when a couple of MPCs are sitting together you need to have a bit of space so for this size since well since fine yeah so we have half the thing already and what we need to do is just adding kind of displacement for all, for all both sides so we'll have exactly same here uh, really easy so the only thing that I'm doing is this minus 120 and this is the number that need be need to be multiplied by kind of side so I will create a new parameter um, side and will be plus one or minus one which needs to be multiplied uh, multiply a vector 120 and I will add a new pin and this one need to be zero okay I will put something nicer and also comments later that's just to be faster in doing the streaming uh, achieving something so what we need to do is duplicate all of them but in that case it's just um, so I will put all of them row it's the same column same 
and this one will be minus one and this will be plus one Uh, let's see if everything's working. Uh, more or less working. The only thing is just maybe the displacement needs to be bigger or smaller or things like that is not working well. But yeah, I see what's currently this is fine. But it's also adding according to uh, the size. So yeah, that we have already the parameter here. So in case that is going this this way, we need to be adding the 70. But also this will need to be multiplied by, by this number. Um, so this is the side also need to be multiplied. And I will do just this. Now should work. Well, it is just uh, minus this one did be the opposite one so well I can just do here minus 70 and that's all had the same effect just multiplying the number Okay, as you can see, we have already spawning all the bench that we need to have. So all of them have been created during the gameplay. And what we need to do now is just removing the mess, so you cannot see the mess in that case. Uh, we will need to create also a few parameters for uh, sitting on this side, but not sitting from this side. For example, here, as you see, instead of having uh, the option to sit here, but because I have uh, another bench is ready and then adjusting for example the degrees that you can rotate when you're sitting here so a few parameters per any of the um, messes that we are just spawning and uh, finally we need to add them to um, we need to add them to an array that have been used by the by the charge so that was the main idea I can just put this so to have here at the same time so mm, okay this is a bit dirty I will just uh, clean up a bit later uh, another thing that we need to do is uh, the mess doing this mess um, get static mesh I think uh, set visibility um, to not visibility but even not being uh, visible this mesh, this object the collision is there so that's why uh, the collision is working for uh, for the interactive so you can just sit there and everything because even you cannot see the mess, uh, the raycast is working according to the proxy and don't care about the, uh, the mess already. So that's why we can hide this mess, but anyway, it's working. Should be working. Even if you cannot see the, the mess, so that's, that's fine. Another thing that we need to do is, uh, I will just take one of them as reference, for example, this one. And I see that I have been changing here the parameters, for example, I have changed this one and that one. So that are the one that I want to change also. So this right side block that I want to put here before reconfigure. So, um, get right. Um, Right side block. Uh, well, I will just set right side block as true. So I can just delete this. 
And another thing that I need to do before I'm um, reconfiguring, just to have exactly the same parameters that I have here, is just changing this camera lead me to 60. So set camera uh, camera limit out to 60 of the same parameters and in case that I need more parameters I can just add them or just modify them and then go to reconfigure and it, it will take care of all the parameters that I'm using here and creating the last thing that we need to do as I say is just adding this um, spawn item to the to the list of uh, benches here so what I do is just spawn benches here. It's just first thing that I will do is, is um, cleaning up the benches that we have. So set benches to empty. Uh, what we need to do is just make a right, make a right, but delete this. So empty the array of benches that we have and every time that I'm adding a new one I will add here get and then add a new element for the array and this is the, the one that I will need to do is just this so this is just adding a new bench being available for, for the charge compile and we can save, delete the, the bench that I have already spawning on the on the level and we'll see if everything is working. So what I'm doing is just deleting all of them. If it's not broken, hope it's not crashing. Um, just do all, all of them is fine. Uh, what I need to do now is the charge here. So you can see here, for example, the benches that is known. And what I'll do is just um, hide this one so there's not a new parameter that you can create. So because they are being uh, created by code, so there is not an option here for the charge anymore to assign the benches that you want to have and the final thing that we need to do is just testing if um, everything is working with the spawn uh, benches and not with the one that we have ready in the level so first thing we need to check if yeah the seats are here as you see well, you cannot see, but you can sit here, and I will just take one of them. I will probably take all of them to see if that's working. So this is my bench, and it's passing. I'm just checking about the the grease. Probably it's also too much. And uh, what I want to see also is um, some NPCs that are just taking this uh, those benches also. So I will just uh, put a few NPCs coming here. And I can check about how are they sitting, if they are well located, the benches and things like that. So I will just, um, okay, so I will uh, change the plans for a few NPCs. So let me go here for, I think, pieces. Cool, no worries. If you have questions during the time that I'm doing that, just let me know. Or just uh, enjoy the streaming. That's all. You don't need to be worried about this. Uh, NPCs. Um, I think that's the pieces that I have. And I hope that I have ready the code for plan graph. Mm, or maybe I have been deleting all of them. Um, or did I create? Ah uh, yeah, I was creating already um, NPCs that are doing that. So I will just drop here a few, a few of. Uh, oh well, let me just put in this level just in case. So I will create a few of them uh, that they should be going to the charge. 
and let me see if they are going to the church. Let's try to start. Um, come on, go there, go, 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 go. Since they are not doing anything, let me see. Yeah, should be like going to the church. Ah, uh, yeah, but that's fine. Yeah, I don't know what the problem is. That um, all of them need to be reset. So let me see prayer here. I have four, five. Okay. I need to fix this one. This is something that is really messing, and uh, I want to fix in the future. It's not easy. This set. I will do right now actor or class and then this is player. Okay. And I will for loop for each loop and I will add them to these NPCs. So the target With empties and then it's add and this is the one that I'm adding so yeah it's just easier to add all of them by code something faster okay so they should go to the charge Yeah, I can see a few bugs here on my phrase. So some of them are not working. So ah, okay, okay. Now the only thing that I need to do is just the project need to be need to have the information about which charge. It's just only one. No four. I can do also by uh, by this, but yeah, this will take a couple seconds. Okay. Okay. So they all thing are moving to go to the church. Here, go. Yeah, since the, the, the problem is they are arriving, of course, yeah, I have go here, roar. Time to read 16 known. Yeah, I see. They have a few, a few problems because they are coming to this point, uh, to this point, the red one. They are coming to this point, and after that, the child should be giving them a place to be sitting. You know? So that's why uh, they should have a uh, seat where to sit. But since I go to the church. And they start something called the charge. Uh, go to the charge, and after that, they are requesting for for a seed. I think. Yeah, get free bench. This is the one that they should, they should have a place where to sit, and maybe this one is not working. Um, ah, let me see if they are just creating. If we can just 
add into benches some yeah, yeah I see I see okay yeah just that's a second because what I need to do is just adding here a new one like three benches get add and adding also the new bench that they are as free so it's empty and not busy okay yeah we'll just let's try again Let's wait here for, for them. Let's come in here. Okay. Okay, the problem now is, as you can see, one thing is just been sitting there is fine, but another one is not. But the problem is that, as you can see, that is not blocking. Uh, they should be blocking. So in that case, I can just add here, for example, a few, uh, a few collisions, a few nap mess uh, block to block this path. Or uh, what I want to have is this seat should be. Uh, let me see. No physics, but collision. Yeah, affect navigation. Yeah, the problem is that uh, I'm creating later. So this is not being taking on uh, care when this one is happening. So for that, what I need to do is creating maybe manually could be the easiest way. Because if I'm creating a new box collision for that is now mess, or I'm just creating dynamic, which means no sense for just a couple of things like that. Or if I'm creating my uh, blueprint, it's just creating the whole thing and not just small parts. So I'm just creating one single box. It's just um, hiding all of them from this snap mess parts so I think that I will need to create manually them which is not the best idea okay let me see where this charge is charge here charge gate okay we'll create here a volume um, Thank you for the follow. Wait a bit, you will have your zombies. If it is working well, should be. Yeah. Uh, month for volume, I think. That's exactly that's the one that I want to have. I want to use this one. And should be being known. Mm. You, you have finally. Yeah, this is taking so long. But you have the zombie. Thank you for the follow. I'm streaming every day at the same time, uh, including Saturdays and Sundays. If you are missing some of them, you can just check later on YouTube for the videos. Not to check or watch everything, but just to see what I've been doing in case that, for example, there are something longer. Like, for example, when I was doing this charge, it takes a few days, so you want to see all of them all together, or you are following something that's bigger, you can see like that. When I'm just modeling one single chair, it's just one day, it's all, but yeah, if you want to follow them later, you have all of them on YouTube, but later. Um, what I want to do with this is. What, what's this? Collision. Ah, oh, no, no. Sorry, because I just. This is not the one that I want. This is not, mess, not modified volume. This is the one. So this will uh, break the mess that is not possible to have here walking. So, yeah, things like that. So I need to create a few of them blocking this path here. I will do something smaller, like 50, even less. So what I want to do is something like that. So they cannot just walk on this way. 
but they need to take the long paths to the to the bench. Let's just block it this way. And I need to do the same with all, all the benches, which is not ideal. But so, so they are coming here in case that they have this bench, they cannot go on this way. That was the problem that they have been blocked here. They cannot go on this way, they need to go on this path, and then everything is working well. And I will move this to modify volume charge. I will just name something and organize a bit, move into the charge. Okay, and just duplicate this, Control W, and just moving here, yeah, exactly the same, and what we need to do is just duplicate all of them a few times, so take this, just control W move into this one is it working? yes and again and just one time more and control W I will just just in case that I have a few problems with all of them. But as you can see now, the the path that they are going, in case that they want to sit in any place, they need to go to the long way and not just trying to cut, cut down this. So let's try again to see if they are being blocked or not on on this path. Okay. As we hear inside, so we see what is happening when they are coming. Figure out if there are some problems. Are they coming? No. They are not moving. Why not? Do I have errors? No. What's the reason they are not moving? They were just moving. Do I have broken something here? Okay, so where is my collision box? <laughs> my enough mess. Why is it so small? Enough collision. Okay. Enough mess balloon, which is just covering all the area, playable area, but you can see only this small part being calculated. Do I need to recalculate maybe? Because I've been broken with all of them, yeah, just to be sure. Just in case. Okay, so the problem was that they cannot find any way to go to the charge and now should be working. Let's try again. So they are coming. Okay, so you can see that they're just choosing that that time they have been choosing all the same but at least that's working, another one is coming. We'll choose any other should be. So in that case should be able to sit together. 
and we see this guy. I think I will reduce even more the, the angle that they have. I want to see also how are they going sitting well or not or too far. The legs are fine. That could be even a bit more back, but not really a lot. So, and I want to see if they are just sitting, still possible to pass. I just to be sure, I will just move maybe a couple of I don't know, three centimeters for that. So what I need to do is moving this. Uh, if I remember which one was, this is just I think this. That needs to be minus 63. Let's try. So let's move and wait again. Where are they taking the, the place? They should take any other one, it's just uh, random. So they're being assigned to any other benches. They should be yeah, taking all of them and then a new one is coming. It's far. As you can see here, for example, you see there are two of them sitting together, and that's fine. And they had even space to do that. So let's see, the next one is coming. Yeah, they are sitting a bit, bit back, so you have more space here. Just in case that they are being sitting, you can just move and take another place that is empty. So here you see that there are uh, 24 places in the charts, and the uh, the plans for the NPC they are just coming and then choosing any of the benches that the chart is just giving them for free benches and they are just joining the, the mass and after some time they will be just leaving again and uh, yeah that's that's all the plans they will be waking up and I can just sit here also uh, yeah and to see that's all together so in that case well it's not much but I will just leave as it is, that seems fine. I can just slightly turn the angle. So, okay. The, um, I would like to align all of them. So, sorry. I'll move them to the charge. Um, where do I have my charge? Is it already there? Are they already there? Ah, yeah, they are right there. Okay, so that's, that's the charge, and that's the one thing that I was just planning to do today with the charge. And the, another thing that I'm doing just for finishing, I have still 30 minutes. So, what I will be doing is just um, doing a few of uh, level design because I want to add a few. Uh, wool barrels that I was just working yesterday on it. So for that is um, this is the prop that I was just creating yesterday. I was creating also the lots and everything, and I would like to add a few of them in the, in the level, just uh, for some variation. So yeah, that's that's the another thing that I want to do. I will just close everything here um, yes now what I will do also is adding uh, setting what I want to do is just set this and uh, take the reference for the chart so here get reference so in that case I will do this set chart and that's the one that I need to be assigned. Instead of doing uh, manually, I will just be adding this one via code. So I don't need to be worried about this anymore. And I can just add or delete any of them. So yeah. So this is one thing. Okay, I will create. 
So this is the one working and this one is not used anymore. So I will delete them. And also the variables that are being here in used was there but not anymore. So delete this. Delete this one and that one. Let's compile again. And I will just clean up a bit this but out of the camera that is main so boring. Just adding a few things here. What I'm planning to do maybe is just restart the editor because I have I don't have much RAM and um, after working with blueprints always having a kind of leaking memory or I don't know what the problem is but I have some problems with that. So just let me save. Um, restart again in a second. I don't have enough RAM. I see that that's a problem. So we'll wait until it's just being cleaned up a bit. <sighs> Sorry, guys, wait, wait a moment. It's, uh, as you see, there are already problems with the RAM. But I'm just starting uh, in a while. <laughs> this taking too long, as usual. Sorry. Let me check if uh, maybe just have some. There's no. I was just thinking that sometimes you have this uh, crash report working and it's not uh, giving the option to uh, close the editor. But since that is not. Don't forget to check all the all the links that I have been creating with the, with the website with more pictures. I have created also a Patreon page. Anyone you want to support the, the game and download, for example, the line the builds. Uh, I have this whole channel if you want to talk when I'm not uh, streaming, and yeah, and YouTube channel where you can check all the videos that I'm uh, uploading later with uh, all the streaming that I'm doing. So in case that you want to check something that was in the past. Okay, since that is not something something in my computer. Okay. Yeah, since I have such problem that it's not possible even to do anything with this until I don't know for some reason what is exactly doing. The, the thing is just uh, Unreal is working here. So that's why using too much RAM, too much hard drive and if I'm closing this one of course my level is being broken and they can uh, lose a few things so I need just to wait for that. For no reason, I don't know exactly what is this one doing. Since already moving, so yeah, perfect. So we can start again the editor. And it will take faster because it's still on, on RAM cache. So. Or maybe not. Jesus. Yeah, the the 
realizing it's trying to open again so you can see here this is the one that's running but yeah it takes a bit of time this is just really slow the hard drive as you can see one megabyte second two megabytes really really slow okay here we are and I cannot do any other thing like for example over in Blender and doing something in the middle or I just try to open a few pictures we can see a few new pictures or new areas that I have been doing in the meantime but yeah the computer is completely busy and I can do nothing Okay, so finally Sometimes it happens, and this is not the first time that I just uh, needed to, to finish the, the stream because it's taking like maybe 10 minutes, 20 minutes for nothing. I hope it's just starting in a while, and uh, we can always finish uh, this level design that I was just planning to do if my computer is responding. really really long I'm really sorry but I can't do nothing just uh, sometimes working with blueprints I have a lot of instance in my level since like uh, leaking memory for some reason and then after some time working with blueprints I need to close and restart again and it's really really long if I'm not doing that uh, Unreal Engine is crashing after a few time and I'm losing everything that I was doing and so on so there is no much options for me to do that I just want to show you a picture that was just working um, let me just do I have this okay Let me see just this one, like this one. This is one of the pictures that I was taking this week. As you can see, this one on Twitter if you want to see with more details, and I think you can find also on the web. Um, well, I'm pretty happy with this one. I was just trying to do completely different. It's still, there are some few things that I need to fix here, for example, that is too blocky. And I think I've been already added a few things more. And I was also fixing this one since like uh, flying. I was just already fixing 
so that's fine how is it going this almost there I really don't know what the problem is. Sometimes it's happening it's taking really, really, really long to open for some reason. I don't know. And I really hate when it's happening and during streaming because I'm not streaming is fine, but just people waiting for 20 minutes just to open the editor. I understand this really too much. But as I say, I can do nothing. Really, nothing. The computer is just 100% working and. Nothing's happening. Okay, finally, since opening, if we have not lost anything. Okay. So finally, thank you, Unreal. So I think it's adding this one. So let's um, change time of the day. Something more bright lighting. Okay, finally. I think I will add first a few of them on, on the farms. And let me see, we have a wall. There's already plenty of things, uh, so there's not much space that I would like to put there. So maybe I need to delete a few things to add new ones. Um, here seems that I have some space, so I will try here. No, the one that's this is the label that I want to put there. So this is just a bit bright. Because uh, I need to wait later, but if that's working, I will add I don't know something here, a few boxes. Oh, it's too big. I'm not sure right now if this one is the right size. I'm afraid that I did so small. Okay, let me see. Well, it's just uh, a little small, but could be the right size for for NPC managing this. So yeah, this is the object. Just trying to play with that to see if the uh, this is the right size. I 
Let's search from So let's say that this one for example was using this um, Yeah more or less that's, that's the right size So yeah since that, That's the right size so just on the on the ground seems so small, but but this is the right size. So I was just already checking for this. So okay. So I will continue adding them. And a few boxes or things around that's supposed to be that you are carrying them when you are using it. Hmm, really not much. What about doing this one smaller? Yeah. And I will create also this but smaller. Maybe not too much. Okay. So small that yeah, I'm pretty sure that I can walk around and over it also. So yeah, you can, you can just go here. All the houses, all the boxes. I think this one is, yeah, is missing with this. So I need to be another place, displacement. Mm -hmm. That is not missing. Right here. Now it's fine. You have this one, this one, that one. I will change maybe. This one, as uh, you cannot walk here over that. So the collision conquers on it. No, and I will do the same with them. But I will keep this one as it is, just to see. Um, hello, champion. Yeah, I'm. Uh, yeah, I'm using Fuse for for the characters. And I'm using Mixamo for the animations. Yeah. Okay, in that case you are not. Well, in that case you can walk, but not this. For some, yeah, that's okay. Yeah, yeah. All of them I have been I have been doing on fuse, and then young exporting. Uh, the thing is just um, exporting on FBX. Well, I'm doing on Colada, I think, and then modifying on Blender a few things like the uh, name of the bones and things like that. But just small things. And yeah, and then reuse the animation. Also, I'm using exactly all of them the same 
uh, bombs and of course they are using the same animation but some of the NPCs are taller or smaller than others so what I'm doing is just using this retargeting and also I have women and men and they have, I have a few problems with the animation so I cannot use them at the same time so I have like two different rigs, one for men, one for women and on the blueprint animations I have also different code for men and women so this is a parameter for the character so I can know about this uh, what I'm doing so yeah, all of them are fused but um, uh, animation from Mixamo but this is bad news I have received already that fuse will be the beta has finished and will be soon uh, you need to pay for to use that so uh, anyway I was just thinking really to use all them as a placeholder until I have better characters and better animations uh, but yeah if they are just cutting down uh, that's the only one that they have I have maybe three of them or four of them and two girls so yeah anyway I was just planning to do something or we'll see because I don't know also about the price but I heard Mary's is like $20 a month which is too much for me so I'm not using anymore so what I have already will be working fine but I will not maybe create more yeah also they have a lot of strange things the animation from me are not so well so I should really I should do my animations but at the moment I'm just reusing going faster and trying to improve later I will add also for example here Um, you're welcome. If you have any question or want to see when I animation or any code, I don't know what I've been doing, just let me know. But yeah, that's well, if you, if you have downloaded already, fish, you know how it works. Just um, check the edges in, in a while. I will put here maybe another one. And um, where do I have this? That's the one that I would like to put just over this one. Maybe I also reduce the, the size like that. Mm, looks fine. Can I have another one? here something that is small something so big it's not matching well uh, maybe this kind of thing but just reducing size uh, the scale something smaller One way and also I will like that. I will align a bit better. Just to have some variation but at the end since more realistic you are just having already here. And yeah, that's fine.
yeah, yeah, that's, that's colliding, I think. Yeah, a bit. So, something like that, it's fine. Okay, so you will have a few things like that. Um, I would like to put also some of them uh, on a wall, I don't know where. So I have a few things ready here. Um, what well, is this empty? But there's a window here. Okay, so we have another small strip here also. Okay. Mm. I tend to find uh, a wall where we can put maybe here. Let's try this. What I want to do is this one. Something like that, if possible. I think this. Um, just to rotate it. In that case, it's just. And the last one we need is just matching gear. The thing is just moving a bit to the left. Okay, so we go. I want to add also here this. Mm, this one is too big. This one is too big. Yeah, I need. Maybe I think smaller, smaller boxes. Of course, I can just change here the size, but for example, this one is not so realistic, so small detail for the uh, good. For example, you are not doing something so complex for something so small. So that's why it could be not very realistic. But I will do that, and also smaller. Finally, painting the ground something uh, dirtier. Mm. Okay, I think this is the last thing that I'm doing today. So, if uh, painting, uh, something smaller. So if you have any question, want to see something, um, Green Bomb, thank you for the follow. You have the zombie. Thank you. I, I think I don't, I don't. I have never seen you before here. If you are new here, if you have any question or want to see something, just let me know. Maybe you have been here before. I don't remember. So I will try to add maybe one more, and that's all. That's what I'm trying to do today. Mm 
I will try also on the uh, the wall but something like that well, let's move initially to the right position and I will just rotate later so this is one and then what location I'm not sure if it looks nice here, looks like that. Mm, really not much. As you can see, for example, comparing with this one, it's so big. This one. So just trying to do something smaller. Probably I need to model a few more with less details, something more simple, but can be more realistic being smaller. But anyway, at the moment, what I have is this so I will do also smaller let's change time of the day because uh, it's just in the saddle if I try something like that or maybe something in the evening that's the only time that you can see. Well, just for modeling, I will just hide all the trees. So it should be, yeah. Lighting here. Okay, we try again the trees. This area is always under under the saddle, so you cannot see a lot. But just to try to add a few things, more detail. Because some parts are plenty of things, but other parts are almost empty. This area, for example, seems a bit empty. Maybe I will add a boost later or something like that. Some, something more, not exactly the same for all of them. Here you have. I will create this here. Makes sense. Mm -hmm. Here, already add a few things. Mm. Is this static? Yes. Why? Okay. Because I have rolling in the, in the past, I'm just checking this one. I see so wide because this one is uh, under the saddle all the time, and something wide you can see a bit different from them. So, even like that, I will just create all of them the same. This is not so bright here, and definitely I need to put here another one where I don't know where, but definitely I will. This is the right place to be covering with things so maybe here something like that well. hmm. I don't know okay uh, let me check also at the bay house Oops. Where is the way house? Here. Thank you. Yeah, I, I was doing everything. All of them, all the props that you see, the houses, even vegetation, trees, as I said before, also the character values infused. But all of them are being done, even the rocks I was also doing. 
the charts, all the buildings, everything that you see, all the props. Uh, most of them I have been doing already on on streaming, so you can check, for example, videos from YouTube, and you can find a lot of things like uh, few houses, for example, this one, the cars I've been doing there, or few buildings, um, most of the pros here, I was doing, uh, I was yesterday, for example, I was just yesterday doing, let me see where is this, if it is or not, or maybe not this one, but wait a bit, I was just adding a few houses with this, well, for example, this church, as you can see here, I was doing yesterday, you know, this one, so that's something simple, oops, uh, yeah, so I was doing all of them, most of them during streaming, not everything of course, but yeah, most of them. For example, all the cards, this model also I was doing during the streamings from Blender, uh, yeah, all those boxes that are really not complex, and many other things. For example, the charts, the wall charts I was doing during streamings. All the charts, all the interiors, for example, the roof here as you can see, uh, the benches, uh, the tower that you can walk inside the tower. I was doing, uh, for example, the the bell. I was also doing the uh, doing streamings, and um, yeah, everything. For example, this door, the small gate here. I was doing also the fences around. So everything like that. Not not only small props, but I mean even big things like that, which of course takes more than one day. But you can check uh, any model if you are interested on modeling. So you can see yeah, most of the things that are happening here. Not everything, but for example, if I'm doing a table or a couple of them, that's fine. I don't need to do five different tables doing streaming also because it could be a bit boring doing the same all the time. So I have been creating a few things uh, and then the rest is just completing. But yeah, all of them. So if you have any question or you want to see, for example, about the lots or number of triangles, um, texture inside or anything like that, just let me know so I can open any of them. For example, the thing I was using this cloth modifier for Blender, which takes a bit of time, and also and then modeling uh, texturing on uh, Photoshop. But as you can see, the models are quite simple, uh, not really so complex. So all together looks fine, and also the, the textures are fine, but as you can see, they're not really, really complex models. So there are a few things that are more complex, for example, the, the water mill, because you have all the interiors here. And I have been, for example, modeling the, the wheels that are working, all of them have been working, and it works during the game, and you see things like that. But also, they are not so, so complex, you know, it takes a bit of time, of course, but more than, mostly are just boxes, with a few variations, but yeah, no, no really, really complex models. Also thing. This one I was also doing during a streaming, as you can see, really, really simple, for example. They're not really complex things. Yeah, so... Yeah, every, well, everything that I see, I, I, was, I was doing. Also the code or aligning, yeah, texturing, the user interface, for example, to see. Yeah, everything. So you have any questions about any part, you're welcome. So the big house. Mm -hmm. Here, that's the big house. I'm not sure if we can add also here another one. Oh, we have some space. Mm -hmm. Is it planning to be? Because I don't want to block also the the pass here and so let me see how it looks. Mm, not very good. And the only ones this small grass that is messing. But I think that being like that I cannot pass. So 
let me leave it and then try to walk. Well, it's something strange because you are going over the proxy, and yeah, and then you can see that you are being blocked for that. So yeah, I need to fix this. Maybe we will put on. Um, another side here, or I really don't know. Because I was thinking, planning to put here this area, but in that case, is uh, well, not a good idea to have this one here. And I would like to have bigger grass around. It's too empty. Anyway. Uh, yeah, I will add another one here also that I have feet space and this is the right place to put things. Not really missing. Oops. Mm -hmm. Maybe I will not add more because of, of course I don't want to have every single house or farm having this one which was something quite popular but I don't want to put all of them Maybe this area we have already So yeah um, We have even here uh, Definitely I will put one of them inside If I have space Yeah I think I have So I will put here Mm -hmm. Oops. What we need to do is rotate him for the world. Maybe like the I don't know. Maybe not so easy. <laughs> Adjust here because there are a lot of things ready. In this um, storage house. So let's try. Yeah. And we need to rotate. There are not much thing to do here, so I don't care about blocking, walking or not, there's nothing to do. So yeah, it's just a bit blocking, passing, but you see that that's fine. It's a bit white because I need to bake the light, but to have exactly the same color as the rest of the thing have.
Okay, let's see what I'm starting. On the say inside. Yeah. Too white at the moment, but it will be fixed later. Also need to save this. Let's see what everything is fine. And the last one that I want to check is uh, this one. We can cut it here with a small, uh, small sack. So same thing. Maybe this, which is of course too big, but we can change to something smaller. Or maybe it's too small. Nah, I think that's fine. And duplicate. I want to create another one. Of course, the TV looks wrong. A bit like that. But no, I will just keep at this now. And maybe we'll create a new one over them. And a bit rotate. That. Looks good. Um, something bigger, just to change uh, some random variation, not to look exactly the same three times. And maybe this one also smaller. If any of you have any questions about uh, the game or just uh, real engine or game development in general, just let me know. Because I see a few people and new people in the chat, but well, if you don't have any questions, it's fine also. You can go and enjoy the, the streaming. If you have any questions, don't be shy and just ask what you want to know. Mm. Can I just put maybe one inside or maybe this one inside? Do I have some space? I don't know how big it is. Maybe it's too much. Yeah, I think so. it's too much to be inside. Yeah, it's too much. Mm. But I want to check if uh, that's possible to put here. So I can put close to the to the door. In that case, it's. Uh, larger and maybe I can put the oops just on the street so the size seems fine and I was just planning to put here but I don't know if I space is this this is a blueprint so this this, this one has already gameplay I was thinking here anyway it's too much really and maybe what I can do is just put outside and replace this box but 
I can put here, I think. Yeah, this is the same problem that the roof is not enough. So yeah, it's too long, too large to put here. As you see, even rotating. Supposed to be. Even like that. Or, well, that is, that's colliding here, not much. What I can do is rotating a bit more. So, it's not so big. Um, Oops, it's just inside. But anyway, just check about the size, seems fine. So I will just try to put go into this and rotate. Oops. Is it fine? Anyway, it's just colliding and it's not working well. Is it not working well? I will just delete. No, I don't see this is matching well. I need to be. This is so small, it's not possible to put inside. I have a few other buildings uh, bigger, for example, things like that. So yeah, I could put just inside in the future. I have some of them already closed, so it could be just put inside. Or. I can just put here, for example, but in that case you have ready, so there's not. Okay, I think I'm, I'm leaving the streaming here already because I've been streaming for more than two hours. I hope you have enjoyed. Don't forget to check all the links and also uh, click the follow button uh, to be notified when I'm streaming. I'm streaming every day at the same time, like two hours more than the current time. So if you have missed some of the streamings, you can just check on YouTube channel and I'm uploading later all the videos. So if you don't have any questions or you want to see something more, I will uh, come back tomorrow again. Probably I will be modeling because I have a few things that I would like to do. Um, yeah, so I will be modeling tomorrow. So if you want to join me, just come back. Thank you everyone for coming. Hope you enjoyed and like it, learning something. And have a nice day. Bye bye.